he revived us. He made us alive and he raised us up and he caused us to sit in heavenly places by grace you are saved. And now watch this. Here's the reason that he said he did it. Why did God do that? Well, why did he do it? Why did he do it? Ephesians 2 verse 7. So that in the ages to come. I've said this before but it's so appropriate this morning. So that in the ages to come he might show his exceeding riches in his kindness towards us through Christ Jesus. What does that mean? It means this. The reason God saved you. Yeah, I've been waiting for this. Why did God save me? Okay, here's why. So that eon after epoch after millennium you will continually be mind blown in the presence of God as he continues to pull back the veil more and more and show you the facets of his kindness that were brought to you through Christ Jesus. They're exceeding. They're exceeding. And this says here that he did it. Listen, hey God, he did it according to what? His own purpose. His own purpose. Like, that's, that, that for me is hard to digest, that God actually specifically chose me. Yeah, that's what it's saying. Like that word there, according to his own purpose, that means this is according to his own will. This is according to his own plan. This is according to his sovereign reasoning. This is according to his intentionality that is multidimensional in eternity. Okay? Bring all that, kind of bring it in here. And then he says, I chose you on purpose. 